The video that you see shows rotation plasty. Last time we talked about bone cancer and we particularly talked about our osteosarcoma. Rotational plasty is a surgical procedure that can be used to treat malignant bone tumors that occur around the knee to be specific this is the distal femur or proximal tibia. Rotation plasty preserves the lower leg and rotates it so the ankle will function as the knee. The lower leg is attached to your thigh bone which is the femur. Now the ankle joint will be used as the knee joint. This leg is rotated at 180 degrees, hence the name rotational plasty, which is the name of the procedure. Major nerve and blood vessels to the foot are saved. Your calf muscles become your thigh or will function as your thigh muscles. Rotational plasty is most often used in or used for young children under the age of 12 who have so much growing left to do that other types of limb salvage options may not work well. With physiotherapy, the patient will learn to use the foot and ankle joint as the knee joint, as well as uh, the prosthesis that uh, fit on the foot, which allows more mobility than if they had taken off the whole leg. They can be able to engage in high impact activities. Other options like a limb salvage will allow the patient to retain the leg, but as they grow, they will be returning to the hospital, get their prosthesis adjusted or lengthened. And also it will mean that are no longer being able to play, run or engage in high impact activities. So together with the patient, parents are left to, uh, to make a decision considering the child's future and if the child would like to engage in high impact activities like sports, they will be happier with rotational plasty than limb salvage.